finally, finally, we've been waiting months and months, but we have an We got an adoption day! <laughs> Yay! Our kids are gonna be our forever kids coming so soon, and I'm so, so excited. So we did already surprise all of the kids with the adoption day, and it was the sweetest moment. So, oh my gosh, okay, but you won't be able to see that video until we can officially show their faces, so you'll see that soon. But one of the kids did not react how I or how I thought he was going to react. Agreed. And uh, here is that little clip of his reaction. I thought it was gonna be early. It's only in six more weeks or seven more weeks. What are you thinking? I wish it was earlier. Yeah. It'll go by really, really fast. So as soon as he or they had found out the adoption date, it was this whole surprise. This is actually going to be the most unique adoption that we've ever had. It's it's done Absolutely. way differently, and you'll figure out why it's way different than any other adoption we've ever had um, when you see that video in a few weeks, but um, he immediately, like his, he like facial drop. Yeah. And then he went and sat down on the couch and started crying and uh, the little clip that you saw was after a few minutes later when I was like, what is going on? Like, it's not what I not expected. Not the reaction you expected at all. Yeah, and he was just like, I wish it was sooner. I wanted the adoption date to be sooner. Like they all wanted it to happen in December and then he's like January at the latest and so for it to be pushed out as far as it got pushed out, like he was just really disappointed in how far. So it was actually a really sweet reaction, but I didn't know that it was sweet until he had said that and I was like, oh, he just wanted his adoption to just happen and be, you know, and just, I don't know. Okay, so it was the sweetest thing. But I think for little kids, it's really hard um, to understand time frames. Time passes differently for kids, you know? It doesn't pass as quickly as it does for adults. As you get older, time passes by more and more quickly. I feel like it goes by so fast and oh I'm like, goodness, slow down! Yes. But I know when you're kids and you have to wait even a week or two for your birthday, you're like, oh, it takes forever. Yep. So I was thinking we are gonna take our son, our soon to be forever son, um, out on a little adventure today. So I thought to help the time pass, we could do an advent calendar and we're gonna go pick out some things from the store. We're gonna do a whole calendar. You'll find out the official date as soon as we put it all together. Um, but, and then every day we'll do some kind of activity or he'll look forward to that and he'll be able to mark it off the calendar so that hopefully time goes fast and then their adoption is officially here. So he should be home from school any minute and we're going to go pick him up and then go take him on this little special date. Let's do it. Let's go. I'm so excited for this day. I, know. Ah, I can't believe it's almost here. I wish I could give you guys details, but. You're gonna watch. Them. We can't. We can't <laughs> until you can see their faces. Like, uh, okay. So, okay, let's, let's go. go. So, we can't say his name yet, but Chez is his nickname. And he is home from school. How was your day at school? Good. <laughs> it was good. All right, we're gonna go to lunch first. Where do you wanna eat? It's your favorite place. It's <laughs> uh, <laughs> a lot of pressure. That is a lot of pressure. He has a lot of favorites. Maybe Little Caesars. Not what I thought you would pick. <laughs> <laughs> Are you wanting pizza or wings? Breadsticks. Oh, breadsticks. He oh. loves their breadsticks. <laughs> All of Garden does have good breadsticks. Okay, it's Little Caesars it is. Little Caesars it is. Let's do it. You know what's the best part about eating here that I never even thought about? Is that we can take the food and go eat anywhere we want. Is that cool? <laughs> There's a park actually right around the corner that we're gonna go sit and eat at that's fun. I don't know, I love that and we could be outdoors, so. Perfect choice. Good job. So I'm dropping Aaron off at home really quick because he has a couple things he has to do. So he's not going to eat with us, but he's going to hopefully meet it up with us in a little bit. 
What did you just say? I said, and I shaved my arms so all the hair on my arms can't warm me up because it's gone. <laughs> it's like how people don't shave in the winter time. Like their arms are less legs because like it keeps them warm. I've never heard that in my life. And like you you shave it during the summer because it makes you hot. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> So he dropped his drink, so I'm gonna show how to open it carefully. Without overfilling it on myself. It's a lot of pressure in there, actually, it's not good. Oh, wait, hold on. It's gonna overfill. It can get all sticky if you spill it on you. No, I'm good at this. And I don't even drink soda. <laughs> Did you see it almost went over? <laughs> now you're gonna get all of your pants. No, I'm gonna cry if I do that. Uh huh. Look Yay. at that magic. I'm trying. Mm -hmm. Oh, there you Logic. go. Logic. Now you have the sanitizer. <laughs> All right, do you know why we're at Walmart? Uh, no. <laughs> you have no idea? <laughs> so. You're excited? Okay, that's good, that's good. Um, so I was thinking, you know, the other day when we were talking about your adoption date and you were sad that it was so far out. So what I was thinking is we put together a reverse advent, or not a reverse advent, I'm used to our Christmas stuff, an advent calendar. Do you know what that is? No? Okay, so basically it's a calendar that's like a countdown to your adoption day. And then we get to do different activities and different fun things so that the time goes by faster so your adoption day comes faster. You like that? Okay. Okay, so we're gonna do one of these bags, and then we're gonna put different things in each bag for how many days are left till you're done. Ariana, what is that? SpongeBob slippers. Cynthia and I can match. She oh my has gosh. these. We need a twin. <laughs> They're five dollars, Mom. Okay. okay. They're on the clearance section. Oh okay. my gosh. We're picking out calendars. So what, January, February? Mario Kart, do this one, do this one. A new day, a new beginning. Oh, the Mario Kart's yeah. cute. Those are the Okay, you pick. You wanna do that one? For sure? Yeah? Okay. Now we're down the game aisle trying to figure out games and different activities to put into the bags. They have the weirdest games now. Like, what the heck is avocado snack? Avocado? Av uh. Look how big this game of sorry is. What? Okay, we're gonna get it. She's too much. Oh, yeah, yeah. A little fun fact real quick. So when the kids and everybody met um, the our three new kids for the first time, it was um, the girl's birthday. And then two days later when they moved in, it was the other one's birthday. But the youngest, Chaz, <laughs> when he, his birthday was two weeks before their birthday. So we missed his birthday by two weeks. We didn't get to spend it with him. So I am gonna let him pick out some like Xbox and some things that he want as like a late birthday present. But yeah. And then next year we're gonna have the most epic birthday ever. Right? Yeah. <laughs> We found cute neon colored um, note cards. I don't know what my mind went like for a second, index cards. But with these, we're gonna write on whatever activity, we're gonna write something to get to know each other more or whatever on these and put this in the bag, so. Pogo sticks! This is like my childhood. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, wait, I have the pink one. This will be our today activity. You want a pogo stick together? Yeah. I can pogo stick. 
So I put some Jolly Rancher Valentine's stuff in the cart for me, obviously. And we're gonna see if she buys it and like see if she notices. I don't think she will. She'll probably when she's getting she'll be like, who put this in there? And I'll be like Says they're Jolly Rancher. You don't cards. even go to school. <laughs> I don't care. Who are you writing Valentine's to? Mm, my siblings. It's a kind gesture, Mom. She'll appreciate it when she sees a um, little Jolly Rancher sucker with a no on her bed one day. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. So the Pogo stick said 20, but I guess they were on clearance for five dollars. So I ended up getting a few more and we're gonna all jump together with the new kids and it's just gonna be so much fun. So I'm excited that those were on sale. We maybe got more stuff than I expected and I don't think they're gonna fit in the little paper bags. So she wants to see if she could like reach to kick me in the head. She's probably gonna end up knocking me out, but so we'll see. No. No. That's gotta be higher. No. Dude, you're gonna like break your leg. You got boom! Or just boom! Wait, let me do it, it. Alex. Yeah, no, that would have missed. That would have missed. If you guys are wondering where Emma is, so she is currently at softball practice, that's why she's not here yet, but her reaction to the adoption date, she started crying and just had tears in her eyes and this like, we had the sweetest hug, it was just the sweetest moment. I can't wait for you guys to be able to see that video. It's probably not gonna go up until their adoption date because I want you to be able to see their face expressions because it was literally just the sweetest moment ever. Um, but Erin and Emma are cooking dinner tonight when she gets home from softball, so that should be happening soon, which is gonna be super cute. Let's see who can do it the longest. Definitely him, definitely him. I can barely even do it. The world's gonna win. I can barely even do it. Okay, you ready? Three, two. We are gonna start putting together our little thing. Bob the Builder doesn't know what we're talking about. That's just his nickname, that's not his real name. But, um, so hey, what we're basically doing is we're gonna put cards for every day until your adoption so that we have like an activity or something so that the time goes by faster. So, we have 41 days. Come put the marker. <laughs> it looks like a paintbrush. It does look like a paintbrush. Look at this marker. Okay, so then I'm gonna go through and write. So a month and 11 days. One, and then we'll do, basically it's a countdown to your adoption. So we're gonna start at 41 and then go 40. I don't know how to count. Yes you do. <laughs> You're silly. Okay, so take some cards. You can have a pencil or a marker. Do you want that one? Okay. 
Good. And then write something on the card that we can do together that's fun, that you enjoy doing. Like, so it could be, you can put building Legos, or it can be just a question if you want to do like get to know you questions. It could be anything. We have to write 41 of them. So we've got to come up with a lot of things. Trade a moment. Look how big this smiley face is. That should go in like number four. like four. four. No, like number four. How about three days before? Yes. Logan, do you have any ideas? Yes, tell me. The fun me. activities that we can do before <gasps> their adoption? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what? Uh, do you have any ideas, Freddy? For what? So before their adoption, we're gonna do an activity every day so the time goes by faster. Where did skate park again? That was a disaster. Yeah, because <laughs> everyone was like, there were so much people there. there was so we went to the skate park. Mommy. Remember, Mom. and then we just went to the trampoline park Mommy. instead. Mommy. Mommy. Oh yeah. Mom. It is oh. way too cold for that. Pool yeah, party. puppies. Pool party. No puppies. <laughs> dance party. Oh, dance party? <laughs> Let's do it. I love dance parties. Those are the best. Number one, you're going to see your adoption shirts that we're going to have made custom. You can pick me up from school and take me somewhere. No, yeah. Kids day. Oh, a ditch day? Yes. Kids ditch day. School day? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. Take a rocket ship to the moon. But this is my favorite. That would be fun. I'm down. Huh? Go to NASA. We're so lucky to Go to NASA. <laughs> this is pick adoption shirt color. So I don't know what color they want to do their shirts. You know how they call you guys Irish twins? Yeah. Because yeah. you guys, so they're not twins, but they're like basically 11 months and actually Which right is... under 12 months apart. So it's called Irish twins. So now we have a twin sandwich. Oh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, what, actually I'm going to start with you, Erin. What are you most excited about? This adoption or after the adoption or just in general? We have not talked about the adoption or uh, what, what's going on with the adoption, so we can't say so, that yet. Okay, so let me let me think for a second. I'm most excited for the adoption and where we'll be when the adoption happens. How about that? Okay. I, I, I gotta say it. As, I gotta say it as slyly as I can. <laughs> okay. Can't fair. give out too much. Too much of the deets. <laughs> for me, I'm most excited for them to be our forever kids. And for it to just be official and not feel like this like in between and caseworkers and all this like I'm just excited for them to just be my kids. Okay, which one wants to go first? Me. Okay, go ahead. To spend time with my family. Like a lot. Oh, I'm excited to spend time with you too. Uh I am really excited to have a forever family. What else are you excited about? How were you guys' you first Christmas with us? Good. That good. was really fun. Was it good? Yeah. Was it everything you had hoped it would be? Yeah. Yeah. But better. But better? Yeah. Not better. Yeah. Oh. So they were a big fan of holidays. But now that you've spent Halloween and Thanksgiving and Christmas, how do you feel about holidays now? Okay. Thanksgiving better. was fun. Yeah, Thanksgiving was fun. That was the best Thanksgiving I've ever had, actually. <laughs> I would have to agree with that. You're so good. Let me ask you, if there's something that you could do, what would you do for your birthday? What would be the best birthday ever? Yeah. Getting a dog. Oh. <laughs> I feel like they're all saying that right now. We do not need 18 dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Seven of our kids had, cool. a, had a puppy on their birthday? Christmas list. Yeah. Um, I would like a dog too, but I'm so excited to be a pettit. I can't wait for you guys to be pettits. Well, I'm just so excited. I can't wait 
for your guys' adoption? A twin sandwich. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do on adoption day too. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but we are going to mark off the calendar and each day when you wake up you get to mark an X until it finally gets there. So we'll go ahead and mark, yeah, we're on the 26th so you can mark all these days off. Yeah. Yeah. See how close it's going to come? It's going to come fast. Next one? Yeah. Oh my gosh. That was so cool. Wasn't that so fun? I know. <laughs> The last one should be you. Okay, we'll do a very last. You get to experience it. Oh my gosh! Let me mark the last X. Oh my gosh! Whoa! Oh, look, look. Okay, so but, up. Oh, what you're gonna do? Hi. Oh, I like it. The adoption day, guys. Here it is. And then we're gonna circle it. That's official. Their adoption day is March 10th. I know. 